has a couch in a, in a greenhouse or, or a wash machine in a greenhouse. Metro Councilwoman Donna Purvis says she's sick and tired of this mess inside a community greenhouse in the Shawnee neighborhood. Part of the Shawnee People's Garden on North 44th Street is overgrown and deteriorated, and Purvis says it's been that way for several years. We've complained about this many times, and many times I have been told it's going to be taken care of. The garden was created more than a decade ago and was intended to be used to grow fresh produce for people living in the area. But its leadership has changed hands over the years, contributing to the issues maintaining it. The Food Literacy Project, we have only been on this property for about a year, so we inherited a lot of the circumstances that, you know, preceded us. We're left with this mess. And it's not fair. Not only are neighbors concerned about the condition of this community greenhouse, they're also frustrated that all this stuff that they call junk is spilling over from the next door neighbor's properties. The person who lives next to the garden is facing multiple fines and violations from the city for all the stuff he's left outside. He's been ordered to clean it up by mid-April and stop illegally dumping on city property. For him to come here and make this his own personal storage is preventing us from growing fresh vegetables and making them accessible to the neighbors in this area. The Food Literacy Project says they are aware of these concerns and have started the process to fix up the community garden. We share the same concerns. We have been having conversations with this neighbor on an ongoing basis and then um, with Metro Parks as well, who is the owner of this property, to try and resolve the issue because this isn't the kind of neighbor we want to be or the space that we want to present to the community either. Madeline Carter, WLKY News.